Wife's in the middle. Give me one second. This we'll do a quick video. No, no, watch out for the camera. Hey, it's Walter Van Dusen at Cineo Expo LA at the Warner Brothers Studio. One of the companies I was looking forward to as uh, Robocup. I got told by my buddy Peter that you need to stay hydrated and he recommended me to get a Robocup and how awesome it is that the founder and his gorgeous wife are at Cineo Expo LA with a full-fledged booth and he's just going to give me a little bit of a, uh, all of us how they started the company. Well, thanks, Walter. It's great to meet you. Really, uh, back, great to be back at Cine Gear. The RoboCup's been around since 2011. Did not start off as a film product, more boating fishing, but now it's adapted and fallen in love with the film industry and we're just uh, making more and more products. But started off as just a double drink holder that converts into a fishing rod holder that can be a lot more than just fishing. And it's just a double spring loaded, patented, go anywhere. And then, it kept going, and RoboCup said made a bigger attachment for the Plus. We got a plate now and a tool holder. So it's growing, and we're listening to what you guys want. Is, and what do you have that's new here? So the, the, the plate's brand new, the holster and the... What's the plate? The plate is... I'll hold it for you. So if you just have RoboCup, now you're hungry. And you put that, so now you got a plate. So your food can go here, your screws, your tools, and it's dishwasher friendly, and you can you can put two of them on there. And now you have a plate. Like, or a mic holder. Or a mic holder, or you put your phone on there. So this one I'm really proud of, this I is did, brand new. Wow, I didn't see that one. He, so what he did was, uh, he said, hey Walter, come back. If, if, Walter, <laughs> if he doesn't come back, he's not gonna see this. <laughs> yeah. That was smart of you. We got full of surprises Come this way a little bit. Thank you. Full of surprises. What else is new? You, you, had, you have the cool orange thing on, my, on the leg for the big boy bottles. Yes, the Robocup and Plus. I, do you see what I have in my, in my, on it? The big smart water. I did that on purpose for you guys. Yeah, exactly. So the, the drinks got bigger since I developed Robocup in 2011. Phones got bigger. So we realized, right, better make an attachment, but not cover one of the Robocups. So it fits on the Robocup and you're not going one step backwards. So it's really just a functional high analgene and hydroflask larger drink holder and uh, fully optional. You don't have to use it, but you can. You can put two of them on there, put a plate on there, and customizable. And how easy do you think this show is for me to roll around here? I think with RoboCup, to be honest, the RoboCup products, even the vest, it really does make your job easier, life easier. And did any of my, did any of my bottles or uh, anything fall off my stand? Absolutely not. It looks like it was safe and secure, right above all your even your electronics, and it's exactly where you need it. Why would you want to bend over? Why would you want someone to kick over your drink? A absolutely. It looks like it's doing a great job. So I used to walk around and have a bag hanging from my stand, and when something's in the bag, do you remember it or do you forget it? Absolutely, you forget it. So, and what was my joke that I told you a couple days ago? <laughs> I forgot your joke. Too. When somebody asked me about my containers, what do I do? Oh, you don't remember? You, you remember, right? The inter so basically what happens is you get tunnel vision, right? Yeah. And do you drink fluids? Yes. No. When, I get when you're working here. No, I do not. Yeah. So you're oh, like the high. Oh, you're right. Yeah, so you're out of sight, out of mind. Right. It reminds oh, you of you drinking. Okay. So yeah. what the joke for me, every single time somebody That's said, right. nice cup holder, I took a drink. I took a sink. Do you That's see right. the bottles empty? Wow. So, so do you? So That's do you? That's incredible. So do you know that how many people talked about my the cup holders? That's amazing. That's so the amazing. The two bl black bottles are empty. The two big ones, the bottle on the right's empty, and the other one. So every single time somebody said nice cup holder. Wow, you took a swing and you hydrated. That's, it's the friendly reminder. That's what I'm you, trying to say. Yeah, you don't even need an eye watch to tell you. No, no. This, uh, that's it. Uh, there you go. You had something else new. Oh, uh, the best. Yeah, you can do that. The one you're wearing. So this is our version one chest organizer. It's a lightweight, breathable material. It's got it's got nylon buckles. There you go. We got our model. It's got nylon buckles that are quiet, easy to use. It's got tool storage in the front. So a lot of different things you put in there. It's got a Leatherman multi-tool here, and then the radio. Or, or yeah, a multi-tool there. Exactly. And the radio is adjustable in the back. So 
It's very adjustable to sizes. You can see Walter is a taller gentleman than me, but it fits him nice and well. And it stays on. And it has flexibility so I can bring it down. I did that yeah. last night. Yeah, you can lower the straps and make it how you want. And, so, wait, wait, wait. and what was I wearing yesterday? That You were wearing the RoboCup shirt. No. Nope. Oh, the... Before I got this vest. You were wearing a very heavy vest. There's a lot of material. It was photography vest. Yes, photography and vest. And when we took it off, you said, how heavy is it? It was extremely it was, heavy. It was heavy. Yeah. And you immediately put this one on and everything fit on. And I said, I said, I felt like I was wearing a plastic bag. And as soon as I put this on. And it was lighter. And you actually were sweaty in the other one. <laughs> and I just got here. So RoboCup's been in business since? 2011. Started in a garage. Uh, in a garage. Well, it's, small, it's a small home-based business, oh. but we have our own warehouse. Yeah, yeah. When, when you started? Started in my, in, my, in my garage, in my office, and just kept tinkering and supported my family. They're patient enough, and now we're here now. So this, so I've been coming by the booth a few times, and it's so busy. This is the reason why you come to trade shows. You like meeting, you get, why do you like trade shows? I got to meet so many people that I've been connecting with on Instagram, like new, yourself, new dealers, new ideas, feedback. And like yourself. Yeah. I'm glad to meet you. Yeah. New friends. Yeah. Like, and, that, and every time we see each other, you know, Absolutely. I'm coming. Yeah, that's why you come to trade shows. City Gear Expo uh, went from Paramount to Warner Brothers. Uh, as always, there's a little growing pains with parking and such. And some people, yes, they couldn't get in. But I think we all really enjoyed Warner Brothers. The staff inside, I think everybody was really pleasant. Oh, yeah, absolutely. This, this turned out really, really great for RoboCup. And the abundance of support and love that we've received That's from the public has been phenomenal. Yeah. And we also we have really appreciate it. And we also absolutely. have some great news. Uh, somebody graduated what? Uh, Sixth grade, our daughter Audrina yes. graduated sixth grade yesterday. And what was cool, uh, the good mom left. What, what time did you leave yesterday to go to the graduation? I left around 2.30. Yep. See? Hardworking uh, people, but they do support the children, and she was at the graduation. So you want to do business with people that are genuine, nice, and friendly. Thank you. Do you well, you, you do too, right? Yeah. I'm just saying that. Your, your whole heart. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is a short little video. I, just, I had to come over here. I was on the way to somebody else, and I said, I'm, I'm not going to leave. I was bugging them a lot. And then, you know, I'm like, right? I was like, no, I was. Right? Why? Well, I was bugging you because I wanted to get to, get in here. So, RoboCup, uh, if you don't have RoboCup, you're dehydrated. So, stay true and stay friendly. Spilling your drinks. Yeah. Spilling your drinks. Kick it over. Yeah. All right. Have a good one. And this has been Walter Van Dusen and AJ. Larita. From at. Welcome. At. TheRoboCup.com. Thank you very much. And there we go. Oh, wait. Not bad, right? I, that bad winging it, right? That was rad. I, I thought you liked it. Mentioning my other daughter's name. I felt so bad. No, no, but you. I'm just showing you that I have a memory. Yeah, I you do. Amazing. Yeah. And all the people you met here, that's pretty amazing. Well, you meet these nice people. No, I know, but still. Thank you so much.